We are in Visio 2016, and let's take a look at how we can resize our shapes and change the direction of which they angle. Let's start out by going ahead and adding in our right triangle. And we have lots of different ways we can resize this particular picture. So if I left click on it, I can move my mouse until the arrow appears and you see resize shape becomes an option. Now I'm going to left click and drag until it becomes the size I want. Now I'll click away to make the box disappear. Let's go ahead and do the same thing with another shape. There we go. And let's choose the right side this time. Now you can see when we do the corners, it keeps its same shape. It just gets larger. However, if we use one of the middle sections, either the top and the bottom or on the sides, and we change the way the shape looks. So we make it extremely long that way, long and skinny, or we can fatten it up until we get the shape that we want. Now, besides changing the size of the shape and the shape itself, we can also change the angle of the shape. Let's go ahead and delete this shape and move our original picture back in. And I can just left click and drag the picture over whenever we see the cross appear when we left click. All right, so let's go ahead and change the angle that the way this is showing. So let's go ahead and go to this very top area and let's left click and drag and we can see something cool happen. We are changing, there we go. We're changing our angle to point a different direction. Now it looks more like a standard triangle. There we go. And we can, of course, pick it up and move it around wherever we like. You see when I move to the edge of the screen that it actually makes the screen a little bit larger. But then it makes the other side a little bit smaller. So what it's doing is it's automatically adjusting for where you want to put the picture so it's not actually off the page. And that's a new feature. That wasn't around in previous versions of Visio.